The Scorpion News is a public forum for student expression. Students make all content decisions, and opinions do not necessarily represent those of the HUSD. See you guys, that looks fun to watch. Go ahead and support them tomorrow night. One more thing about football. Did you guys know that somebody in grades K-8 that's interested in cheering with our wonderful ladies can actually go cheer with them on a Friday night varsity football game? Our Asbury High Scorpion Cheer Team is hosting their very own junior cheer clinic for grades K-8. Swing by room N27 or the, athletic, or the athletics office to get a registration packet. Registration is October 2nd in the library. Would you like some guidance from someone your own age? If so, come visit an advanced peer counselor in the counseling office. They offer support in your academic life and also help resolve issues that you could be going through. They're available periods one through six. Now on to our seniors. Do you want a quote in the yearbook? If so, you must purchase your yearbook before we go on Thanksgiving break. This will be your only chance to get your own personal quote in the yearbook. So be sure to go purchase your yearbook now while there's still $70 with an ASB and $80 without. Also, the ASVAB is also coming up. The ASVAB is a career exploration program open to 11th and 12th graders and is required for military enlistment. That will be offered on Wednesday, November 8th. The financial aid will be on Wednesday, September 22nd, 7th, beginning at 6 p.m. Come on over to learn about the FAFSA and California Dream Act applications, requirements, and about grants that can help you pay for career training in college. Parents are encouraged to attend and there will be a presentation in Spanish class for those that need it. Now that we're done with the school news, we have Val Cisneros with their weekly segment that highlights the news of the week. We're calling this news in a minute. Happy International Day of Peace. I'm Val Cisneros and this is News in a Minute. To start things off, let's get some recognition to Stephen King who turned 70 today. Selling his first novel in Carrie in 1973, he's come a long way. In fact, the latest IT remake racked up $189 million in the box office, office ticket sales. So saying he's come a long way is quite an understatement. If you watched the Emmys this past weekend, you saw Donald Glover, otherwise known as Childish Gambino, accept the award of Best Director and Outstanding Lead Actor in the comedy series Atlanta. Not only did he take home two Emmys on Sunday, but he also made history by being the first African American to win an Emmy for working on a comedy series. Congrats to him. In other news, a recent bill requires pet stores to sell rescue animals. This means pet stores now have to work with animal shelters if they want to continue to sell cats, bunnies, and dogs. Speaking of dogs, an Ohio bride teamed up with the dog rescue organization and changed the game completely. Instead of a bouquet, she had her bridesmaids carry adorable eight-month-old puppies. All right, let's wrap this up. I've got some puppies to look at online. I'm Valerie Cisneros, and this has been News in a Minute. Have a possum day. Thanks, Val. Let's help all those animals find their forever homes. Well, that's all the time we have for today's show. Hope you all enjoyed this week's Scorpion News. Don't forget to check out our Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube. Find us at Scorpion News for more announcements and stuff. I'm George, signing out.